Hello! In this video I unbox, set up and connect the laser mono multifunctional Canon MF270 series. I will show the following in this video and you can find my full product review in the upper right corner of the screen. There are two models of MF270 series in the following configuration. Find the on-screen product online manuals for more information about the product specifications and features. In the section about the machine you can find the differences between the two models. In this video I set up and install the MF275DW. In the second part I unbox and show the boxed and product dimensions. See the data on the screen. Next you can find what is in the box after unboxing. And for full unboxing see the next few minutes of the video or skip to the setup part. Setup disk is available, but I will install the drivers and software from download page in the next video. Scanning the QR code on the hard copy manuals will take you to the product online manuals already mentioned previously. I am setting up the new printer, so I power on for the first time. It is not recommended to connect USB cable before installing the product. Select Display Language Set Remote User Interface Pin, which I use to access the product admin settings. You will find more about Remote User Interface later in the video. Next step is to connect to Wi-Fi. This model supports Ethernet as well. Here I show how to enter the characters of the Wi-Fi password. Small letters, numbers, capital letters,
And finally, you can access the symbols. Finally, I have entered my Wi-Fi password and I connect to the network. My device has been connected and after the first power on, keep the device connected to the electricity for 24 hours to charge the internal backup battery. There are many functions to be set and used in this device and some of these I will cover in the future videos. Before using the printer, let me put some paper to the paper cassette. Many different paper sizes can be selected custom paper and frequently used media. Let's do a quick copy test from the automatic document feeder. This model has a quick first print out, 6 seconds. In the next part, I demonstrate connection to Canon Print Business App and login to Remote User Interface, which are two very useful things to do with this device. First, download the app and add the network printer. Let's print a PDF from the mobile. From the settings I select 2-on-1 print layout. Finally, let's log in into device as admin. Enter the IP into the web browser and log in using the PIN, which I have defined during the setup steps. And that would be all in this video. Find more laser videos in the playlist on my channel, there is link in the description. Feel free to comment or like the video if you found it useful. You're welcome to subscribe as this helps me to grow the channel and create future videos. Thank you for watching and sharing. Bye.